Most of us, the holidays are a time for family, friends, and good memories. But for some East Texans, that's something they can only hope to have again. East Texas News' Bob Hallmark has more on those living in shelters this time of year. The holidays are filled with food, family, and gift giving. But for ladies at the House of Hope Shelter in Longview, it's a time of reflection of how they got there. When you lose everything, you're at the bottom of a barrel. People don't realize how lonely it actually is. Um, we tried to bring them in and show them the love and try to restore them one at a time. Most are recovering from homelessness, alcohol or substance addiction or domestic abuse. And most are alienated from their families. Taking that first step in the shelter can be scary. You didn't know anybody. And if you've never been in that situation, you're going to naturally be nervous. Their fellow shelter residents in many ways have become their family. The ladies here, we, we feel like family, we, we connect as family. We support these girls and make them feel loved and that they have an extended family out in the community. Giving to each other and sharing hope for a future when they can reconnect with their families. That they are a value and they are somebody. Many have found their way back. They come back two or three years later and they say, this is what's happened and now I'm reunited with my children. Uh, I get to see my mom, my dad. I, I'm clean and I'm sober and I'm working. Those are the best stories. Well, I'm on my way to being on my own and back on my feet again. They realize there is hope. It does not matter which, where you come from. What matters is where you're going. Bob Holmark, East Texas News. Well, the House of Hope Women's Shelter in Longview has been in operation for 18 years. It's helped thousands of women reclaim their lives and reconnect with family. Just incredible.